Lafayette County until 7.15 p.m. At 6.35 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Brownstown, moving east at 25 miles per hour. That's heading this way. Expected hazards include tornado. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near St. Elmo and Brownstown around 6.40 p.m. This includes Interstate 70 in Illinois between exit 68 and 76. During severe weather, keep these safety rules in mind. Move to a reinforced shelter ahead of the storm and stay away from windows and doors. Mobile homes and vehicles should be abandoned for a sturdy shelter. If the storm is producing tornadoes or extremely high winds, take cover in a basement or interior room on the lowest floor. If outside, avoid isolated, tall objects and flimsy buildings such as ships and picnic shelters. Thunderstorms can produce flash flooding, so avoid driving across flooded roadways. Remember that tornadoes can occur before a warning has been issued. The time is currently 6.38 p.m. Central Daylight Time. You are listening to NOAA Weather Radio All Hazards, Station KXI 46 in Shelbyville. The National Weather Service in St. Louis has issued a tornado warning for Central Fayette County until 7.15 p.m. At 6.35 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Brownstown, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near St. Elmo and Brownstown around 6.40 p.m. This includes Interstate 70 in Illinois between exits 68 and 76. A tornado warning remains in effect until 7 p.m. for Central Christian and Central Sangamon counties. At 6.30 p.m., a confirmed tornado was located over Edinburgh, or 9 miles northwest of Taylorville, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards included a damaging tornado. A tornado has been confirmed by train spotters. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This tornado will be near Taylorville around 6.35 p.m. Other locations in the path of this tornadic thunderstorm include Stonington. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 6.45 p.m. for northwestern Christian and southeastern Sangamon counties. At 6.31 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Edinburgh, or 11 miles north of Taylorville, moving east at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Edinburgh and St. Chris Lake State Park. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7 p.m. for West Central Fayette County. At 6.31 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Vandalia, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees.